So, I'm gonna show you guys a little outfit of the day. Oh, your outfit of the day? So I have this flannel on from Brandy. It's a vintage one, I got it a few years ago. I have these shorts that were my mom's from the 90s and there's a huge hole in the crotch. And then I have my leg warmers and dance <laughs> shoes. <laughs> It's a look. Fashion, right? <laughs> it's just this I can't get over. <laughs> it's so ugly. Hey, are you calling me ugly? You're being so cute though. Hi baby. You love the car, you love your your little collar slash harness, you love the leash. Oh my goodness. You love the vet? And he just woke up. Yeah, he loved the vet. We went and he, well, I didn't go because I had my appointment. Dan brought him and he was so happy the whole time. Yeah, he was a super good boy. Yes. Yeah, we had fun too, huh, in the car, just me and you. He's so good in the car. Yeah, he was just practicing being all alone in the back, being a good boy. I don't know if you remember from a few videos ago or not, I was talking about buying some new shoes because I wanted some like nice-ish casual ones that I can wear every day sort of with jeans and sweaters and you know whatever So we just got a few in the mail today and I'm gonna open them up and see what they look like I'm not really sure what they're oh my god boo is on the box. Alex put them on top of it. <laughs> oh boo Come on boo. You're gonna fall off. Don't chew on that. Okay, come. So oh boo. Oh my gosh She was chewing this thing. Here take your toy. Where's your toy? Where's your toy boo? Come on Boo Good boy. Come in. Come get it. There's a store here in Montreal called Essence, so we got a few shoes from them because it's really easy to ship back and stuff in case things don't fit or don't look right. Okay, so, ooh, first one. Hey, it says my name. Sort of. <laughs> ooh. Nice. Are they what you thought? Yeah, I like them. Those are super nice. Yeah, they're higher than any other shoes I've had before. I like them. I'm gonna have to try them on. Although the laces aren't done up at all. Yeah, I think you just have to have do to, it yourself. I think it's because you can kind of do it to whatever style you want in the laces. Okay. Is that kind of what you were looking for? Yeah, this is perfect. Because it's like not super, super like fancy, but it's also not like a running shoe, you know? Right. It's like an in-between. It's a sneaker. Yeah, it's a sneaker. It's like a good everyday sneaker. And then this is the other one. Some Adidas. Adidas. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, I like the material. Yeah, these are perfect. These are gonna be so good. I love them. Okay, I need to try both of them. On. I really like those a lot. Yeah, let me do these ones. First. Ow! Boo! Oh my goodness! Good boy. Those look really nice. Do you approve, Boo? Oh yeah. How do they feel? Fits for sure. Yeah? Yeah, 100%. Oh, they're so nice, babe. Oh, okay, these go in from underneath. I don't know what style these are. They're just like the originals, but they're different because they're uh, maybe stand. They're so kind of like a suede ish. Like a suede ish, but it's not really suede. I can't. I don't know what it is. It's a material. Oh, those are sweet. Yeah, these are so nice. <laughs> With the pants and the socks. So good. Oh yeah, these are comfy. Swag. So nice. Those are gonna be so nice with jeans and stuff. Exactly. You wanna try the other ones? How would you tie the laces on that? Just like a normal. Yeah, like the same as the Adidas. I'm just gonna take this away from you before you go completely insane. He's like, hmm, what the heck is this? Ooh, are those daddy's new shoes? Is this what you had in mind? Like this type of? This type of shoe? Yeah. yeah, so you think, well now you have two pairs so you can switch them up. Yeah. And you don't just have your, oh my goodness already, he's showing his shoe laces. Ooh, come here. Come here. Sit. Nope. Sit. Nope. Sit. Oh my goodness. You're perfect. Do you want to come up in my lap again, Boo? No, he wants a sneaker? Good boy, Boo Boo. Try not to put them too tight so you can put them on after. Now he's happy. Those are sweet, babe. Yeah, these are nice. These are you would wear them with jeans or sweatpants? My favorite. Those look comfy. You like bands, you were saying, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah, these are so good. You know what would be so nice if you had your jeans kind of rolled up? Yeah. Because you wouldn't want to put the jeans over yeah, the shoe. Yeah, perfect. Here, stand. Just to see. Yeah, it fits so good. How's it feel? So oh my god, it reminds me of my when I went through a skater boy phase. Skater boy, but when I went through a skater phase in uh, sec one, and I thought it was Avril Lavigne, and I had shoes like that, and they were really, really thick, and I had skinny, skinny ankles and legs, and it looked so funny. You're so cute. Do you want to open my box? 
Oh, sweet! Those are so white. Oh, no. They're gonna get ruined by Boo. No, they're gonna get ruined Wait, by they're pure. Velcro! Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. They're I didn't like, know they were Velcro. Like platform Velcro. So cute. Oh my gosh, again, it reminds me of when I was a kid. That's pretty cool. I wanna try them on. That's sweet. I have a similar pair that are pink in the back with laces and I wore them all around Europe. They're the most comfortable shoes ever. They have a bit of a platform. Yeah, these are gonna get so dirty. Oh like, look at that goodness. big Velcro thing on top. It's so much surface area to be dirty. No! Okay, I need to try them on. Those look so nice. Right, Boo? You like them? Guys, I got Velcro shoes. How cute. How cute, Boo. You like them? Oh my gosh. He's gonna get them dirty. I love the platform and my little cut. Oh my god. Oh, I thought that was dirty. That's just my size. 37. Or what is this? 37 and a half. Which is weird because if I get 37, if I get seven and a half in like Adidas, they're massive. But seven and a half for these are like perfect. Babe, look at our new shoes. I know. Ooh, sorry, Bubba. Sorry, Bubba. I'm gonna take these off before he goes crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, how good do I look, huh? <laughs> Sometimes I can't take myself seriously. This is too funny. <laughs> you are so adorable. I love you. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You wanna play, huh? You wanna play? Do you see daddy's new shoes? Mm hmm. Are these like the exact, this is like, you're happy? Mm-hmm. Okay, This is good. exactly the kind of thing I had in mind. Yay! So, as you can see, we opened up the house. So, no more little gate thing. We did close off the office in my closet because I am reorganizing that so there is literally clothes all over the floor. And every time he goes in there, he runs and just dives onto the clothes. It's really cute, but like, he just makes them dirty because his paws are dirty. <laughs> And then the office room, we like to keep an eye on him because, I mean, he's outside right now, so I could show you, but he goes crazy on this carpet. He'll like run in circles and try to attack it. I don't know if it's because it's the color, because our other carpet is fluffy like that too, and he doesn't go crazy on it. It's for some reason just this one, he like is obsessed. And I have some more clothes over here that I'm trying to like organize. We also have like wires on the ground, and he goes crazy for these paintings that we haven't put up yet, and all this stuff. He's jumping up on these trying to grab the books. So we're just gonna keep this room closed for now, but that's fine. Um, as for our shoes, we want to put them away because I guess because he smells our feet or something and he goes crazy for those. But everything else, he's pretty good. We put the gate here so that he can't fall through the banister because he's still small enough to kind of fit through. And then we're getting a baby gate tomorrow, but <laughs> for now we just put this blocked barrier uh, so that he can't get through and he has the whole rest of the kitchen. Oh, there's Dan <laughs> and Boo. But yeah, he uh, kind of goes crazy on this carpet, more at the tassels, but we sprayed it now. Oh, there's a little dust ball with this stuff. This is supposed to, like we spray it every time he pees in the house because it takes away the smell of the pee and gets rid of stains, but we kind of sprayed it all over the carpet so that it doesn't smell like something he wants to mark. So I think that's what it is. He doesn't really have to pee, but he wants to mark it. And uh, yay, he's got the whole house now, minus the downstairs until he's bigger. So much room for him to move around and play. So cute. I just got a little gift from Tarte. Oh my gosh. I guess this is everything that comes in it. Good boy. That is amazing. Oh my gosh, they sent me a brush set. What? <gasps> that's so nice. Oh my gosh. Sit. Thanks, Tart. I'm assuming this is that. Good so this boy. is the treasure box. Sit. Then, or no, actually no, this I think is, yeah, this is the, the blush bazaar. Then these are the high performance neutrals. That's so nice. Then this is the treasure box and then this Sit is the Lip Bling Top Coat. Ooh, pretty. Nice, wow, that's so nice. And then I got this package from Call It Spring. I don't really know what's in here. Oh my gosh, how cute. Wow, I love that. Good boy, good job, boo. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, there was stuff inside the backpack. How cute. These are earrings, and then this is this really awesome hat that has this like detail stuff on it. This is so cool. Good and then boy. some NYX makeup products. Oh my gosh. Good Perfect boy. for fall. Good. We're teaching him not to go Good up on the couch. Boy. 
All right, it's much later in the day now. Actually, currently it was a six, or it's glaring, 6.09 p.m. And uh, we're getting ready to make dinner. Alex is in the bath, so we got the bathroom door closed. But I don't know if you guys noticed, but we got the house all opened up. So we changed it today for Boo, and you can see him there. The biggest thing we need to work on, which I've been trying to be super diligent with today. Oh, see, he's gonna go do it right now. Come here. Good boy, Boo, is making sure that he doesn't chew the carpet. Because he likes to chew on this one, he likes to chew on the green one and the white one that we have in the bathroom. But as long as we stay on top of him, come here. Come here. See, he likes to do that. What I need, what I need is a bag of treats, and I need to praise him when he lets go of the carpet and doesn't bite it, because otherwise he's going to chew on it and he's going to pull like he's doing now. See, a little bit of correction, and it works, hopefully. But I've spent a lot of the afternoon cutting up our treats into much smaller ones, because I don't like giving him the big ones. It's easier, oh, good job, boy. Good job, boo, good boy. Sorry, I know you guys find that annoying, but he just smelt the carpet and looked at it and then put his head down to relax, which is exactly what we want. We don't want him playing with it. Good job. But yeah, anyway, so now we have a lot of little ones because then you can give him like 10 and it's not even equal to one of the big ones, you know? So it's much easier to train him and not overfeed him. But I try to alternate too, like I don't do a treat every single time. I try to do just praising sometimes. Like right now he did really good and I just try to praise him. And uh, I mean, sometimes I'll get a little frustrated, especially when I work work for it with him like right now we worked for a long time oh good boy he was about to do it and he didn't good job boo good job that was perfect way to go buddy such a good job but yeah i haven't been vlogging much because i've been spending boo come here it, you have to be super diligent it's really hard to let go for even a minute because you have to be really on top of it especially if it's behavior you really want to correct young so they don't do it when they're older good boy boo good boy oh perfect good job good boy anyways been trying to get back into the regular swing of things so i've been going back to the gym i went two days in a row but because i took off a week my body is like really hurting today from the two days in a row so i took today off and then i'm gonna go try to go like three or four days in a row after that and get back into my like once a day six times a week routine that i usually did see like this is a moment where i get frustrated because we work like for 10 15 minutes and he still goes to bite it after boo good boy so at least he's not biting it as aggressively and as much as he was before. Come here. Good boy. Here, grab your ball. Get your ball instead. There. But I'm gonna try to get back into the swing of things of doing the normal everyday routine. I really just took like a week of absolutely nothing except him to really try to get a good jump start on housebreaking, crate training, doing a good job, making sure he's comfortable, making sure he's not developing any like loneliness anxiety or separation anxiety. I dedicated like an entire week to really doing that. And so now it's about transitioning back into regular everyday life, vlogging, editing, going to the gym, working out, going out to do stuff, seeing friends. Now that he's becoming more and more comfortable alone, we're gonna try to start working on having him be alone at home. So in the next few days, we're gonna be testing like the both of us leaving and leaving him here alone probably in his crate, like put him down for a nap, leave, come back, and hopefully he'll either still be asleep or wake up and be comfortable like he is at night. Because in the mornings when he wakes up, he's usually pretty comfortable. He just sort of sits there and waits for us to get up and get him out to go to the bathroom. He doesn't whine in the morning, and he's been doing really good, and that's mostly because he's not having really any separation anxiety or feeling like he's being secluded from his pack. He's comfortable being either fenced in like we had half the house before or being in his crate. So he's doing pretty good. Right now he's smelling around looking for, I don't know. He, he's smelling the kitchen a lot because it's all new, right? It's all new stuff, new smells. There's food crumbs, there's a garbage can, there's a dishwasher, there's an oven. There's lots of stuff going on. So he's still exploring, looking around. He's being a good boy. Okay guys, Dan and I are heading off to our appointment that we have every Thursday. Dan's mom's actually coming to watch Boo today. My skin is literally so dry because of the treatment that I got. It hurts so bad. Here, I'm gonna zoom. Can you see all the dryness? Look at that. Oof. But I decided to wear makeup anyways because my face was looking really, really bad. And I was like, you know what? If I go out in public like this, people might think that I'm crazy. So this is what I'm wearing. I have this super old tee from Brandy that's just the softest thing ever. And I love wearing it. My Gucci belt with Citizens of Humanity's mom jeans. And my... Gucci slides. Same bracelets and rings as always. And then as for my lip, I'm wearing this thing that I got yesterday from Tarte. And I don't know what shade this is. Dan, can you read this? What does it say underneath? MF41 Novel. Oh. I don't know if that's the shade. 
I don't know. That seems like a it's like a print. Oh. Like a shipping info. Maybe on the back. Quick dry matte lip paint. Yeah, but I think that's the shade. Maybe it's novel. Novel, maybe. I don't know. It looks more like something printed on that. It looks like your moment. shirt color almost, yeah, just a bit darker. We are ready to head out. I'm gonna grab myself. Oh, Dan's got his new shoes. Let's see over here. <laughs> we have friends over this weekend. Let's grab protein bar. Oh my God, there's more in here? What the heck? I did not see the other flavors. Peanuts. Mmm. I'm gonna do the peanut butter one. This. Sparkling water. Dan, is it too much protein if I have a protein bar and a protein shake? No. The RX bars is only 12 grams. Oh, really? Okay, because I haven't worked out today yet. Uh, I usually do this after my workout. I'm gonna grab an apple, which we have from apple picking over there. And then also make sure to have my multivitamin. So I have my B12 and then I take this, which is Centrum for Women to make sure I just got all the good stuff because I have been feeling so crappy all month and I realized it's because I was forgetting to take my B12 pills and that is a huge factor in like mental health. If you don't have enough B12 in your system, you're gonna feel so down. So I'm telling you guys, B12 makes you feel real good. We're back from our appointment, guys. I just took a really long nap. I was so tired, oh my gosh. Sometimes that happens to me, I eat lunch and I just, I zonk out. But Boo's been like really acting up lately. He has been in a biting rampage. Positive reinforcement is, <laughs> seems to be not really working because he is just biting everything right now. I mean, he's outside, I'll show you guys. Oh, he's crazy. Hi Boo, you gonna be nice for the, for the vlog? You gonna go make a pee pee? Make a pee pee, Boo. Good boy, make a pee pee. And then he gets distracted by every single leaf. Boo. His teeth are getting really sharp. Come on, Boo, make a pee pee. Make a pee pee. We just don't know what to do because there's just literally a million leaves everywhere. Go make a pee pee, Boo. Good boy. Make a pee pee. Oh, good boy. Good boy. Good job, Boo. Good job. <laughs> Guys, we were just brushing Boo. Look at this. We're training him not to like bite it, but look what happens when he wants to bite it. Good boy. Wait, Dan, put it on the floor again. Look. Good boy. Good job. Good job. You don't know. You don't do anything when you see this. It's just there. <laughs> I can't help but laugh. Good boy. Feels so <laughs> he's like, mommy, help me. Good so boy, good. boo. He thinks he's not afraid of it. He's just kind of wondering what it is. <laughs> see when he like puts his face next to it? He spazzes. <laughs> Say bye-bye, subscribe. See you all in the next video. Give it a thumbs up if you love me. <laughs> a lot of his fur came out. I'll say bye, babe. Bye. Bye, baby. Boo, come here. Come here. Good boy, baby, good boy.